This video is brought to you by Jeff Schultz Painting. How to use paint to make a small room look bigger. Do you live in a small space? Paint colors can do more than just beautify a room. Here are some clever ways on how to make a small room look bigger. Small rooms can feel confining when they only span a few square meters. But did you know that the right paint colors can make a big difference? With some interior design tricks, you can turn a pocket into a mansion. Here's how to make a room look bigger with paint. Decorating a small room isn't easy. Deciding what to with the limited space without making it cramped or soulless can be frustrating without the right knowledge to make the right decisions. While you can't actually make a built room's floor area any larger, what you can do is trick the eyes into thinking you did. How am I supposed to make a small room look bigger? You might be asking. Mirror placement, proper furniture arrangement, and good lighting can create the illusion of a bigger room. But the right paint colors are the deciding factor in determining what you see and how you feel. The white is the most obvious color of choice to convince the brain into thinking something is greater than it actually is, this isn't the only option. Here's how to make a room look bigger with paint. 1. Use light colors. Light paint colors can brighten up a room, which, when coupled with natural light, can create the illusion of an open and airy space by reflecting and bouncing the natural glow. Off-whites, greens, and blues are the best choices. 2. Unify the paint colors with the same hue. Paint your ceilings, doors, and trims a shade lighter than your walls. This confuses the mind into not knowing where the walls end and where the ceiling begins. One color throughout creates a seamless look, making it easier for the eyes to move from one room to another. This is because the eyes stop when a color ends, cutting off the expanse of the wall and shrinking the overall space. To complement this, your decor and pillows also have to be the same color, just in a different shade. Another thing to consider is an accent wall. Having one can draw the eye to a focal point, and it works best when you are trying to make an open space. 3. Use the correct undertone. The undertone refers to the blending of shades and tones layered underneath the final color. The dominant color is what you actually perceive. What lies underneath, or what you do not see, is the undertone. For example, indigo is the blending of blue with a black tint. For Dan, you blend light brown and yellow and that same light brown when blended with green is khaki. Look at the color and check if it looks cool or warm. Generally, warm shades have red, orange, or yellow undertones, while cool hues have purple, green, or blue undertones. Figuring out the undertone can be done by comparing it to the primary colors, red, blue, or yellow, and white. You could compare a white paint with pure white to determine if it has been blended to become ivory. Choosing the correct undertone can make or break the vibe the room brings. Your paint color should be based on the undertone of your pre-existing elements, such as your flooring, cabinets, tiles, and countertops. To see if the paint color you choose matches, paint it on a sample board and move it around the house to determine whether it looks good. If you're new, this can be a bit tricky. If you aren't sure how to choose an undertone, it is best to ask a paint expert. 4. Explore dark colors. In the absence of natural light, light colors may look dull and boring. Dark colors are a good alternative as they create a comfortable, intimate feeling that makes the room look spacious. Here is a list of some colors that can help make a room look bigger. 1. Soft blonde, this gives warmth to a small space. 2. Blush pink, this brightens up a room and goes well with sand, beige, and ivory. 3. Light taupe. This is the best option if you do not want pure white but still prefer a neutral tone. 4. Cool Gray. This is another alternative to white, and it makes a room feel fresher and cooler than warm colors. 5. Pale Blue. This calms a room down and works well with a light ceiling. 6. Light Green. This opens up a space while providing a calming effect. 7. Soft Black. This works best when there is no natural light and creates an intimate feeling. 8. Dark Navy. This creates a dramatic yet comfortable environment. 9. Lavender. This has a bold appeal that can add a feel of airiness. With these painting techniques that can make a room look bigger, and by taking into account the available natural light, you can prevent making a small room feel claustrophobic by changing the visualized size and shape. For every interior design need and paint job consultation, Jeff Schultz Painting is the one for you. 
Having been in the business for over 30 years, JSP has mastered the art of residential painting, especially in Sarasota. Visit our website to see some of our works, or call us at 941-374-3672.